Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. And I think to myself, what a wonderful So I'm going to start off by addressing the background noise. You'll probably hear it this entire time because my neighbors are getting a new roof put on today and there was no other time that I could film this. I have worked the rest of the week and I wanted to get this up as soon as I could. So I'm terribly sorry about that. You'll hear some nailing and stapling. I can't, I can't avoid it. I'm sorry. So I went oh, it's heavy. to not the fireworks. I convinced my mom to go with me. Um, so we were actually going to go on the first day of the sale, but we didn't end up going. We were going to go at like four o'clock, um, but it was so much better. We went this morning at nine, right when they opened, we were like one, we were the second people in line and, um, the store was like almost empty. I will put up some pictures that I took while I was there. Um, the store was pretty much empty when I first came in and by the time we left, maybe 15 minutes later, there was about... 10, 15 people and it was starting to get a little uncomfortable with people not really minding the whole six foot rule and everything. Um, but they did have like an intercom saying, please remain six feet apart and um, all their precautions. So that was really good to hear. They made us grab bags as we walked in. So my mom grabbed a small one. I knew I wanted candles, so I grabbed a big one and I grabbed a candle cart thing. Most of the store was only 50% off. They had a very small section of 75% off and a small section of um, the hand soaps weren't on sale any more than they usually are. They were four for 20 or six for 26. Um, the pocket backs were five for eight. Um, the candles were all half off. I didn't see a single 75% off candle. And then they did have some 75% off body care, um, but that was mostly, they had some leftover travel size from Christmas and then some Easter stuff and then just some other random things. Um, but yeah, the whole store was mostly 50% off. And then as usual, the stuff on the side of the walls was not on sale. Um, and then they had $6 single wicks. So that's all the information I have for you. Just a little info dump for you. So I'm gonna actually start with what my mom got in her little bag right here. Okay, so mama went in with the idea to get a bunch of pocket backs, maybe some soaps, and she actually found a candle that she liked. So that was good. Um, so the candle she got is frosted sugar cookie, which she smelled the one that I was going to get and she got it. Oh my God, it smells so good. Okay. So we smelled all of these. We actually did take our time in the store. We smelled everything that we wanted and made sure we liked it. Um, so we had time. We didn't feel rushed. I would definitely suggest going like first thing in the morning if you can. Um, and I could already tell that they were sold out of a lot of stuff. So a lot of stuff in this line was already sold out. Um, they said they hadn't gotten a new shipment in a while. They did have a lot of the new hand soaps, the um, summer collection. They did have some of the new body care stuff. So they had some new things, some new pocket backs, but you could tell they were like lower on stock and people had already scraped through the first day and bought a lot of the stuff up. And then she got a bunch of pocket backs. So she did, I think, let's see. I think she did 10 pocket backs, so five for eight twice. Let's pull them out. So my mom doesn't really like flowery, um, very, very strong smells because we both are kind of sensitive to that. So um, she, I think she mostly got some like fruity scents. Let's see. This one she smelled and already decided she doesn't like. <laughs> this one is Best Fins Blue Ocean Waves. Um, she got two at the beach. This one just smells kind of coconutty. She must have liked this one. She got four coconut coladas. It does smell really good though. It just smells really fruity. I'm surprised she got this one. She must have just ran out of options. She got a fresh cut lilacs, uh, apricot and apple. Thanks a ton. The cute little, um, apple. <laughs> um, and then a pineapple and mango. Oh, that sounds really good. That was mainly what she got. And then we split a um, four for 20 on hand soaps. So she got kitchen lemon, which she's had this before and knows that she likes it. And then she got a sun wash and citrus. So these are those new, um, hand soaps. This is orange tangerine, crisp apple and sugar crystals. So we smell this one. She likes the citrusy, like fresh scents too. So that one's pretty good. It smells just like orange. 
So that is Mama's haul. Now let's get into my haul and find out if I got everything that was on my wish list. Okay, so moving on to my order, here is the second half of the 4 for 20 hand soaps. I got two of my own. So I saw Crisp Apple right when I walked in the store and I knew that I wanted it. So it is apple, summer melon, and sparkling citrus. I'm gonna smell this again. It smells so fresh. Oh, it smells like Jolly Ranchers. That's what it smells like, the green Jolly Rancher. That one's good. By the way, they did not have any Boardwalk Vanilla Cone or um, what was the Cotton Candy one. They didn't have that collection at all at my store. I don't know if they never got it or they already sold out of it, but they had the new um, one as well. I got the blackberries and basil. This is blackberries, sparkling champagne, and basil. I didn't know it has champagne in it, and that's probably why I like it a lot. I love the champagne toast, so that's probably why I love this. It is so fresh, bubbly. Oh my God, it smells so good. I don't smell any basil in this. Maybe when you use it, you'll smell it, but it just smells really fresh and really bubbly to me. So those are really good. Okay, so for my one shower gel, I did stay true and I only bought one, but they didn't actually have any confetti cake pop shower gel. They barely had, I think they had like three body creams, three body lotions and no shower gels. So I ended up getting the strawberry pound cake shower gel. Now I've had the, I've had the pocket back in strawberry pound cake. So I knew that I liked it. Oh, it smells so good. You really get that cake and the strawberry. It is fresh strawberries, golden shortcake, and whipped cream. You really smell, this one smells so good. I smell it again. So I'm not mad that I got this one, but I really did wish that they had confetti cake pop. I smelled it in the lotion and it smelled so good, but I don't need any lotions, so. Well, I don't need any body lotions, but they did have hand creams for 75% off. So I got the one that I wanted, strawberry pound cake, 75% off. Um, actually, let's see how much it ended up being. So 75% off of $6.50, it came out to $1.62. So less than $2 for this little hand cream. And I could have gotten it for free if I had a coupon, but I didn't have any coupons whatsoever. So whatever, it's fine. And then I got Fiji Sunshine Guava Teeny, which I didn't actually smell this, it, but I knew I'd like it. It just smells fruity. So yeah, definitely not mad about that. So I did get my two hand creams. And then they had a whole corner of $6 single wicks. So I got a eucalyptus rain. The eucalyptus mint one that I wanted to get was not $6, it was regular price. So I got this one instead. It really smells very similar to it. Let's read the note. It's eucalyptus, spearmint leaves, and fresh spring rain. You can really smell the rain makes a little bit of a difference in this, but it still smells just as good. So I actually only ended up picking up three through candles. They were sold out of the, a few that I wanted and then some I smelled and didn't like them. So I did get the my own sugar cookie, frosted sugar cookie. I smell this one too. It smells so good. It is vanilla frosting, warm brown sugar, and cookie crust. It just smells really, really good. So. The ones in this line that I also wanted was vanilla chai latte, which I smelled it in store and it just smelled like straight coconut, which there was a coconut milk scent in it. So I knew that that was gonna smell a little bit like coconut, but it was literally straight coconut. So I couldn't do that one. That one was not good. And then they didn't have cinnamon sugar donut, which I also really wanted. So I might go to my outlet later on in the week, like Saturday, once I'm out of work um, and try to find it but I may not end up getting it, so it's okay. I did end up picking up a white caramel cold brew. Very happy about this one. So the notes on this are cold brew coffee, vanilla sweet cream, and warm caramel drizzle. It smells so good, but it does smell a little more caramely than I remember. I'm not mad about it though. It still smells so good, just a little bit less like coffee and a little more like caramel, but it still smells really, really good. And then they didn't have the warm apple pie in the Stars and Stripe packaging, but they did have blueberry pie. And I saw this and I just picked it up. Like I knew, I knew I was gonna get it. Um, juicy blueberries, flaky crust, and sugar crystals. I haven't smelled this since in the store. Let's see. Oh. My wicks are a little wonky on this one. Look how weird. I didn't even open it to look, I guess. It's like all the way, it's like shifted. I hope that doesn't affect how it burns. But, wow, and look how much, is this one like that? 
Right. Yeah, there's like an inch. It should be like this much. That's my fault. I didn't look at this before I bought it. I just knew I was going to get it, so I just picked it up. So, yeah, look at your candles and make sure that you have enough wax in them because this one is not like full all the way. So, whatever. Anyways, let's smell it. This reminds me of something, but I can't remember. This reminds me of some cereal. I can't think of what cereal it reminds me of. Fruity Pebbles? A little bit, but not like full sugar. Wow, that's really good. I can definitely get the crust and blueberries. That's, that smells really good. That's gonna be a really good summer scent. So let me give you, prices on candles were $12.25. Uh, my single wick was $6. The hand creams are $1.62. Um, my strawberry pound cake shower gel was $6.75 for half price. Um, and then four for 20 hand soaps. So yeah, that was, that was everything. Um, I definitely am satisfied. Like I could not go back and be good and not feel like a hoarder. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm really happy with what I ended up getting. I can definitely tell that the stores are a little bit lower in stock this year than last year, obviously. Um, but yeah, I think I did a pretty good haul. Me and my mom both got a pretty good haul. And yeah, let me know if you're thinking of picking anything up or if you already went and shopped. Um, and let me know how your experience was down below. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.